<laughs> well, Dom, it's nice for you to bring me here to your home in Palm Beach. Yeah. I hope it didn't cost much for you to vacation here. Uh, don't worry. I got some little help to pay for this trip, if you know what I mean. You mean that Republican donor? Oh, Jimmy. I mean, Jenny. What are you doing here? Didn't you know I was on the plane with you? Yes, but you're here. At Mar-a-Lago. With President Trump in the room. I don't need any more scandals, woman. Well, Clarence, I just wanted to say hi to President Trump. And you know he's been indicted recently. So he needs more friends to comfort him. Plus, I'm going to give him a plan to solve all this mess and release the Kraken. Remember why I said that on January 6th? You remember what you said a few, few months back? I don't talk to you about my work. You don't talk to me about my yours. So let us stay that way. Yeah. So guys, as you may know, Clarence is under fire for receiving money from a Republican donor to pay for his vacations. Random vacations to Indonesia, Georgia, etc., etc. What did I just say, woman? Oh, good lord. Haven't you two have gotten in enough scandal recently? That's why I just released the Kraken. And Jenny is right. You are the victim of political persecution, Donald. Uh-huh, Lindsey Graham. Let me just say a few things. This indictment will destroy America. The whole thing is a bunch of legal blue. No. Yep, that's right. You heard me say that 500 times. Yeah. President Trump, you don't worry. We got your back throughout all the trials. And let me tell you something about my home state, Arizona. Arizona knows BS when they see it. And this indictment is pure BS. Carrie's right. We can't help but feel sorry for you, President Trump. You are a victim of political persecution. This is gazpacho crap. Uh, gazpacho crap? I think you mean Gestapo crap. Right, it's gazpacho crap. Dear God. The gazpacho police are after him. They're treating him like crap. And so, by my resolution, I am going to make a resolution in the House of Representatives to form a select subcommittee of the judiciary to investigate this weaponization of the New York District Attorney's Office. Because these people are after President Trump, but they're really after the American people. And if me and that select committee don't scare them, heck, no evil thing will. Jenny! What? what? Who are you texting? I was texting Lauren Boebert. Texting her what? About what Marjorie said? Well, don't tell her what I said. Instead, tell her I said, she's an effing moron. All right, I'll text that to her. Wait, no, I didn't mean that literally. And send. Oh, dear God. This is why for most of my vacations, I, didn't I wasn't accompanied by her. Excuse me? Uh, nothing. So, Clarence... Tell us, what were those vacations like? Those vacations were mostly paid by a Republican donor by the name of, uh... Harlan Crow, I think was his name. Heck, if he was here right now, I'd ask him for a paid vacation to Cuba. In December, of course. That way you don't get extra dive back to the United States. Oh no, of course not. I'm just going to vacation there for a little while. Let's say until June 2024. Uh-huh. You're going to get a vacation to Cuba to get out of going to jail. No, no, I was just wondering. I wasn't going to literally get out of jail. Ooh, this is good. I'm texting this to all my conservative friends. Jenner! Look, it's Clarence Thomas. Hey, who let you on the property? A butler. Sanchez. Justice Thomas, are you here on another paid vacation? 
by that Republican donor? Oh, no, 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 no. You see, what had happened was, 